Go ahead, so we got tickets. Here we go. Hey, oh. Shirt. I got two for gauntlets. Thank you. All right. For the last four years, nights like this have been the fabric of the Kitley family. Elizabeth on the court, a star center for Virginia Tech. Yeah. And Raven, her older sister, in the stands, cheering her on. We have a very strong bond. I don't know how we ended up this strong together, but we're really got a strong bond. Their dynamic as sisters, the love that they have for each other, uh, you can see it in their eyes. Even though Elizabeth is the one donning the Hokies uniform, Raven is also an important part of the Virginia Tech basketball family. Fans, please direct your attention to center court as we welcome one of Virginia Tech women's basketball's biggest fans, Raven Kitley. I have autism, so they were honoring people with autism. It makes me feel good because I don't feel like people are aware enough about people with autism. They see only like people like the Rain Man or like people on the, little, on the really low end of the spectrum. They don't see many people in the middle, whereas I'm in the middle. The Autism Awareness Game was really special for Raven to get recognized for everything that she does. It just made her absolute year, like she still talks about it now. We wanted to make sure we honored her because we wanted to bring awareness to the community like she brought awareness to us. Moments like the Autism Awareness Game are possible because Elizabeth chose to play for Virginia Tech, a decision where Raven's opinion was crucial. She went to like a lot of visits with me and stuff, so she saw a lot of different campuses, she spoke to a lot of different coaches, and it was just not even close. Uh, the relationship that she had with Coach Brooks was far beyond um, her relationship with anyone else. They saw not just Elizabeth, they saw me as well, like as a family. Raven just captured, you know, the attention of the whole staff, and uh, she was so genuine, so happy. We developed a relationship with her. Uh, she was as important when they came on their visits as, as Liz was. It felt genuine from the beginning, and Raven definitely felt that and uh, Elizabeth saw that. Recruits get like graphics sent in the mail and stuff and uh, they actually sent Raven like an edit of her. I remember in the beginning, she was really passionate about Star Wars. So when we started sending Elizabeth mail, you know, we would send Raven some posters and impose her in with some Star Wars uh, graphics behind her. I have it hung up in my room in a frame, my Star Wars recruitment mail. I think I felt that we were in pretty good shape. When we went to uh, a tournament and Elizabeth was playing um, and she was playing with her AAU team and there was about 25 coaches on the baseline watching the game. And Raven, on the way to the bathroom, she had to pass all 25 coaches. And when she ran past the coaches, she got to me, she took two steps past me and she put the brakes on, she backed up and she said, hi, Coach Brooks, and then she ran. And all the other 25 coaches just looked at me and were like, who is that? Well, how do you, how do you know her? Let's go, Hokies. Let's go, Hokies. She's just a reminder of, like, happiness in my life. Like, no matter what's going on or what's bothering me in my own life, what I'm struggling with, she's always there to bring a positive perspective. She'll just grab me and pull me in for a kiss at any random time. Um, maybe not always the most appropriate times, but it's okay. I just, like, love on her. I text her every day. We call. We FaceTime. I get pregame texts from her. I just tell them to get the rebounds, play aggressively, don't, don't make any dumb fouls. Kitley the step back, big bucket. Kitley with a block. Kitley physical, that's how you do it. Raven's just taught us all a lot about how to deal with life, adversity, you name it, and just living for the moment. She really loves and values the relationship with all of my teammates and my coaching staff and everything. Um, and she really just feels like part of the team. I have my sweatshirt for autism awareness and uh, she signed my sweatshirt and I got it framed like a jersey and it's hanging in my office and uh, that's how special she is not only to me to us but uh, to Hokie Nation.